A Charlottesville man is giving new life to used coffee grounds. It's not something you think about, nope. day, right? But he read an article about recycling, and so Gary Greenwood then decided to start his own program. So take a look at this. These are coffee grounds that were going straight into the trash. His local Dunkin' Donuts provides him with the leftover grounds. Gary now recycles them, and they're being used in people's homes, gardens, and even as face wash. Some people just put it in their compost pile and, and add more nutrients that way. But it also keeps certain bugs away, uh, like slugs and snails and that sort of thing. So that, you know, you sprinkle it around your plants. Who knew, right? Yeah, and, yeah uh, I do this. You I do? do this for the flowers. They're and good keep, for your flowers. Does yeah. it keep the My slugs always, away? Yeah. I I, the slugs. Oh, I don't know about that, yeah, but uh, it's good for the soil. Let's start a study. Greenwood distributes these coffee grounds to anyone who wants them, and his goal is to recycle more than 4,000 pounds of grounds every year. So it's you go out right and you right. just take, like, the filter and mm -hmm. you spread it around the flowers? Mm -hmm. Yep, I even do it with K-cups. I'll put it in my flower beds. My aunt used to do that. Do you do cut that. them open and? Oh yeah, 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 oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. You'd empty out the Chuck K cups. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> for, for the squirrels cure rig. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Friday. I knew what you meant. But it works, right? And the flowers grow the better. Squirrels appreciate <laughs> it. Go, they they need some do. coffee, too. Uh -huh. 